sorry about the terrible lighting i lights in my living room are off currently i'm just by the window the blinds are just full so today is my brother Ud strong so happy birthday to you steph boo i love you steph -o. i love you so much you know i tell you that all the time i don't ever think i'd be telling you that i love you but i do love you and i wish you many 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 more birthdays ahead healthier ones that is so happy birthday i'm heading down to my mom's and we're just gonna have a little chill line for him because i mean it is technically during the week is a weekday you know work day and it is tuesday right now so i don't know when you guys will see this but it's tuesday around minutes to five and i'm waiting on dean to pick me up because he is coming from work and then we're gonna head down so yeah guys i would see you at my brother's place bye so the other day i went to the tire shop right huh? i went to air of the tires yeah, in the car yeah, okay. and guess how much they charge me four hundred dollars i pay for the four tire because i had to pay a hundred dollars for one and the other he said why you pay so much but the guy told me it's premium air uh, premium air yeah where that coming from well i don't know yeah fine no? But the man, I never tie up tires. You went back and deal with it? No, they wanted to go by safe way we're going. No, 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 no. Four hundred dollars. He's yeah. a madman. That's what we know. The guy says premium air. I don't you care what air. Where it is he talking yeah. about premium? Yeah, what about the bag? Where you buy it from? Yeah. The guy, right? Mm -hmm. Tell him. You want to know the premium air? Which part selling it? So you do, you're not supposed to pay for premium air? Yeah? It have an air that is selling. Guys, so like, um, like them mag mag wheels and thing. Them they they them got tires where it's supposed to be one and thing. Right. Right. Uh, what do you call it? Nitrogen. So you sell pay for that? Yeah, well, they do. There's four hundred dollars that you, that you, that, that oh. is too much of money yeah. or thirty dollars or something that is charge mm -hmm. on nitrogen. On one time. Your car, you don't need no nitrogen. So why the charge was so much? There's a bench you ride rolling with. You don't have to you don't have to put nothing on that. That design that that car suspension design different. So why the charge my four hundred? He rob you, he charge you. <laughs> you get robbed. <laughs> Technically you get robbed and you know there's nothing but that. Well how why would no you have to pay for air? Which part in Trinidad you paying four hundred air for tire? Well, I, went back. I don't know. No. no, I don't want to tell you the name on here, but thinking that you know it might be like thirty dollars, I think. But he said four hundred. So why didn't go right and just um the gas station I have? Yeah. Who gonna eat? So when I the pump man, hey, yo, you know some air that. So when I reach home and I tell Dan, he was like, people don't pay for air. You don't pay no well. No, they charging five dollars a tire. Right. Right, five dollars a tire. Okay. But that money you pay, I'm probably getting some good slap. You <laughs> collecting that day and I give you 200. I slap in and give you 200. No <laughs> oh my yeah. god. Hey, so, what I should do? I should go back and get more money? Are you got a receipt? No. So, how are you going to win that in court? So, it's called my losses. Eh? Yeah. yeah. What do you have to do next time? Go back with the car, right? Mm -hmm. Go back with the car and let it help the tires. And when they're done, they tell them thank you. I have three more times again. <laughs> <laughs> so, you should even tell him that wait, he had to change all the tires? No, he tell me 400 for premium. This is premium air. But it's not, it's, he never tell me number nitrogen. He's I would like to wish my son a very happy birthday. Didn't know I would have. Um, live to see. He made 34 years. Wow. And I went on 52. Way, look at that. <laughs> Had him when I was 18 and my daughter 25. She's 27. Wow. I had my two children at 25. She's 27. Wow. Seven is 34. Wow. Look at that. Nice. Right? So let me hope 
Next year, hold the sale almost finished. <laughs> Next year, you have little grandchildren. Well, a little one. Wendy and Stefan are here. Well, <laughs> and what about you? Excuse me. She I hear you. Oh, uh -huh. I hear okay. you. Okay. Right? So, viewers. My Let viewers them know. love you. My viewers really love you. Oh, thank you. You see, people, I just send her all the comments so she just read it. See all the kind messages. I love them. <laughs> thank you so much for sending me all those wonderful comments. <laughs> okay, look who here. It's his birthday. Hi. Bada bada. So, how are you feeling at your city nine? Forever. My guy's 16. So, where you buy for me? Where for me for your birthday? I have two bottles of water in the fridge. I go take one. I go on. Bye. 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 Bye
guys it is the next day and the last clip that you guys saw was me getting actually no not me getting a facial i finished got my facial and i was in the car and my skin was all red and blotchy and just like bloodshot so red in bother to record because my skin was like so sensitive like i didn't do any peels or anything i just did a basic vitamin c facial and i had some extraction done on the areas of my cheeks that was like really really red so that explains the redness but yeah went to my esthetician because i haven't done a facial in so long like maybe over a year i mean i do facials at home but I haven't went to like a professional and get one done I maybe like over a year yeah I haven't done one you can see the redness kind of cleared up there's still like a spot here and here and those are from the extractions I always say right when you get a facial done your skin looks really clean but you also look busted so you need to like you know give it a few days and then you will see the results of your facial really oily in this area here so i get a lot of congestion in this area and the thing with my congestion usually when you have congestion in your pores it you know a pimple will pop up or you'll get a, like a cystic pimple a pimple that doesn't rise to the surface but they're just beneath the surface and like really hard and painful i used to get those but i stopped getting those but mine when i wash my face and i pass it it will feel like rough but then there wouldn't be like no bumps or no pimples or anything so those are just like dead skin cells trapped beneath um, my skin and my pores so the only way to get those out is to steam your face and then go in with extraction obviously use an exfoliant that remove the dead skin cells and all of that i had a lot of congestion beneath my skin but it was not showing it's been over a year i had a professional facial done so yeah but this is my skin after and i will check in with you guys you guys will see it you know as time goes by but yeah thank you so much for joining me on this vlog and i'll catch you guys in my next video don't forget to stay safe stay blessed bye okay what the hell was that okay no nah, bye